This tutorial will show you how to do Mission 4 Skip, better known as GigaZip. It functions the same way as the Mission 9 Zip, where you do a gold release on a ledge that pushes Dante out of bounds and then back in bounds. However, this is completely skill based and there's an easy setup to do this. This skips two mandatory fights, some platforming and the boss, Gigapeed. It saves roughly two minutes and the game still thinks that you beat the boss legitimately, thus giving you orbs for it. The setup is as follows. You move like this to get the gluttony to backstep into the corridor here. Then shotgun, run up, high time, shotgun. That gets it up on the railing. Then you change lock on targets to the top right gluttony. Wait for the gluttony that you just shot up there to get up. Neutral jump and then roll to the left, neutral jump and move down to back, move a bit forward so you touch the round stone in the background, that way you will have the perfect lineup for the release and then you simply time the gold release. If you want a visual cue for this, it's when the gluttony squats and its arms are on its sides. There are three conditions that must be met for this setup to work. The gluttony must face Dante, Dante must be close enough but not too close to the gluttony and Dante must neutral jump to trigger the attack. First you should move in a circle like this and also turn the camera to have a better view of the corridor. This will also guarantee that the gluttony will not have its back turned to you which completely ruins the setup. Do note that a glitch where the shotgun causes no knockback can occur and that might also ruin the setup. Practice lining up the gluttony first, so that you don't do something like this. If the first gluttony goes flying or you accidentally kill it, you can still use the second gluttony that spawns next to it. If you go too close or too far to the top right gluttony, it will trigger and then it will ruin the setup as well. The only shot at releasing here you have is reverse releasing, which is extremely difficult because you have to not only get in position after baiting the attack, you have to move the stick in the correct direction by yourself and then press lock on and style at the same time. So three inputs to time instead of two. Only a gold release will work here and most likely any miss release will cause the top right gluttony you're locked on to, to trigger. In the event that you mess up the release but you don't trigger the top right gluttony, you can keep baiting this guy to shoot at you and go back to the release position and lock on to the top right gluttony. An example of a setup that looks good, but since the gluttony isn't facing Dante, he simply walks off. And this is what it looks like when the gluttony's back is facing you. You simply cannot do this setup with the back facing you. So you just have to get it up there again. You can make the gluttony get up a little bit quicker by shooting it with ebony and ivory after shooting it with a shotgun. However, that gives you less time to do this. So when you're just starting out, I don't recommend doing this. What can also happen if you misalign the zip, especially if you try to reverse it, is you go out of bounds. You can also go out of bounds by simply walking off after doing the zip successfully. And if this happens, it's game over. However, if you somehow zip right below to where the key item is, you can actually jump and you will get there and you can continue as normal. Another good visual cue is to have Dante's head on the right side of the door, but not outside it. This way you can be close enough, but not too close. And don't stand right next to the gluttony. You can be a bit closer to the camera. I highly recommend installing Style Switcher 3 for the 2006 PC port, as it allows you to reset the room over and over to practice this. That's all. As long as you follow these instructions and keep practicing this, you will eventually get it, and you will start to feel that you know how to do it, and you won't be as stressed during runs. Thanks for watching, and happy zipping!